friends, welcome to DP Tutorials. One of our friends, Sandy A, has asked me a question that how to convert a hundred columns of five rows each with values into one single column of total 500 values. So this is nothing but converting a data range table which is in a matrix form into a single column format. So let us understand this problem and see the solution with a small example like this. Here I am considering an example with a data range from A5 to C8 that is 3 columns and 4 rows. Now let us convert this into a single column. Okay. So, I will directly go to the cell E3 and start typing the formula as equal to index, open the bracket, select the range as A3 to C6, comma, 1 plus integers, open two brackets, Type row, open the bracket, A1, close it, minus 1, close the bracket, divided by, that is oblique, columns, now open the bracket, put the range, same range, that is A3 to C6, close by two brackets, mod, open the bracket, Row bracket A1 close bracket minus 1 plus columns and I can give the range as open the bracket give the range as A3 to C6 close it comma columns open the bracket and put the data range again A3 to C6 close it by two times with two brackets plus 1 and finally close the bracket. Now this is the formula that is required to convert your data range which is in matrix format into a single column. Before entering this formula, lock the references of the data range by pressing the keyboard shortcut A, F4. Ok, A3 and C8 and locking the references. So once it is done, you can enter and press enter on your keyboard to see the formula working. So press enter and you will see the result as A. Then drag the formula down to the cell until you find the error information being displayed. All the data in the range has been transposed that is converted into a single column like this. So you can apply the same trick with the any number of rows and columns and you can convert them into a single stack column. So friends, in this way you can convert multiple rows and columns into a single column in Excel in a very easy way. So friends, I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial. If yes, please do give me a like, share and comment. For further more interesting videos, please do subscribe DP Tutorials. Thank you friends. Thanks for watching.